starting. And today I'm going to be opening a massive mystery pack of just Lego figures, basically. I All I know is I've got some Marvel, some Ninjago, and some random. They can literally be anywhere from all Lego. It's time for my first mini figure. Oh, Looks like I got a popcorn man. I'm not sure where he's from, so I'm going to go and look it up. So I just found out that this minifigure is from the Mystery Minifigure Seasons. So let's add it to the base. Okay, pull out this. Oh, wow! This is Crux from... What is that? A Chronix? I have no idea. Can't tell the difference. From Ninjago, I think. It's got two very nice time blades. And let's add him to the base plate. It is... Oh! I think this is another collectible minifigure from the seasons. It's a little snowman. Take off his hat. It's a person in a suit sweating. Very nice and funny. Let's add him to the base plate. Next minifigure will be... The buyer must have sent me loads of these. Uh, this is another collectible minifigure, but it's a dinosaur. It's got a very nice little tail and head. Let's add it to the bit plate. So let's see. It is. Oh, it's a Ninjago minifigure. I think this is an anachondri. Let's add him to the bit plate. Is. Let's find out later. Put that. Oh, it is a 20 years anniversary Star Wars minifigure. Wow. Put that there. Oh, I've never seen this before. Do you know what that is? Let's add it into the base plate, whatever it is. I think he might be a random, who knows. Okay, let's pull out this. Oh, oh, I got Crux or Chronix the twin. Small time blades, it's a very nice minifigure. Add him to the base plate. What's gonna be next? Okay. Wait, is this another collectible minifigure? I think it might be, it's like a Wolf suit. Man in a wolf suit. Okay, let's add him to the base plate. I think that's another random. Maybe bigger. It's gonna be. It is. Oh, I think this is Ninjago. This is a coal mini figure, I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I think it is. In the very nice robes. I don't know why these robes look so cool. Let's add him to the base plate. I've got 10 minifigures and one mysterious base plate with a trophy on. What do you think that's going to be? Let's see the next minifigure is... So, so, earlier we pulled this one, which is 20 years of Lego Star Wars. And now we have the other version of it, which is the Darth Vader, which also has the 20 years print on. Let's add that to the base plate. Mini figure is. Oh! I think this one's quite rare. Got a Pythor. So this is the white version though. But that's onto the base plate. It's quite hard to get on. <laughs> okay, so. Oh, this is one of my favourites! It's Spider Pig! <laughs> Don't know why they made him Spider Pig, but let's add him to the base plate. That's our first Marvel figure. Let's see, and it is... Oh! This is an exciting one, but I think he might be missing a piece. Let's hope we call it soon. So this is Dragon Jane from Lego Ninjago. He's 
got some massive wings as you can see. Get them on the blade, base plate. There you go. This wing's getting in the way. And I got oh haven't ever seen this one actually. I think it's a gamer. Let's get some headphones as well. Wait, maybe that goes on the stand. Let's put it on there for now. It's gonna be it is oh it's a Minecraft minifigure. It is quite plain. So let's add it to the base plate. Oh, I think, I'm not sure what this is. It might be Ninjago, it looks like a Ninjago Ninja to me. It's like a snake man. Let's add that to our base plate behind the dragon. Okay, how do we get that? Oh, I know exactly who this is. This is Sora from the new Dragon's Rising series of Ninjago. Let's add her to the base plate. Oh, I found a bag. See what's in. This just looks like some random pieces. Let's go through these. The piece that we all saw first with the screen piece remover. We're going to add that to the side of our base plate. Oh no, never mind. I'll go and get <laughs> that. <laughs> I'll be back in a second. Okay. Another pet. I think this might be some sort of robot from Star Wars. I'm not sure who this is. Anyway, let's add them to the base plate. Okay, next thing. This, this you probably recognise. This is just a regular Lego flame. Let's put that in. Okay. Okay, we have a Lego crash helmet. Slide on. Okay, we have, I think this might be Padme's hair from Lego Star Wars. Let's add that. Okay, who else do we have? Some random hairpiece? No idea where that's from. Let's add it. Oh. Okay, there's a little dog. Very, very cute. Look how cute he is. Let's add him. Piece is this lantern. Quite common. Add that. Okay, what should we do next? Probably the commonest piece in here. It's just a little triangle that's um, orange and see through. Let's add that on. Okay, this is slightly rarer. It's a golden egg from Harry Potter. Okay, let's add that. Okay, what's next? There is a little fish. <laughs> fish is extremely common. Let's add them on. Okay, what should we do next? This is a Lego sack. Oh, I think this might go with one of the figures we have pulled. It's got patchwork on, so that goes with Mr. Wolf. Look. So Mr. Wolf has the sack. And I think that's the complete Mr. Wolf. Okay, let's look at them. Okay. Lego Friends hairpiece. Not one of my favourites particularly. Okay. Oh, another hairpiece. I think this might be one of the Time Twins hairpieces. Let's put that on them later. Okay. Oh, this is cool. Sort of Gryffindor from Harry Potter. Very nice glowing rubies in it just a regular katana i love these They're like really really floppy okay finally some headphones never seen those before green headphones oh look the game is wearing them this must be a spare okay oh finally an anaconda sword from ninjago i think okay that's all the pieces See what I get. Oh, I think this is Marvel. No, this isn't Marvel. That's Ninjago, isn't it? This is a Nia. I'm not sure from where. Let's add that to the base plate behind Sora. 
Okay, that's me messing around. Um. <laughs> this is Davy Jones from Pirates of the Caribbean. All I know is this is an extremely expensive minifigure. He should go for around 200 pounds nowadays. Let's add him. Let's see what our next minifigure is gonna be. Oh, it looks like a Marvel. I'm not entirely sure who this is, but I do know where he's from. Cause I saw this in the Lego shop. It is from the Marvel Mystery Minifigures Season 2. So let's add him in the Marvel section. The next minifigure is... Oh, I think this is Spider-Man from Spider-Man No Way Home because you can see by the nanotech suit, it's very shiny. Let's add him in. Oh, this is Master Chen from Ninjago. He's very nice. I love this piece. Okay. Oh, he comes with an anachondry sword as well. Okay, let's add him to the base plate. Ooh, what's the next exercise? Oh, I think this is Chewbacca from Lego Star Wars. Let's add him in the row of Star Wars. It is. Oh, I think this is Ninjago. Maybe this is Kai. I haven't actually seen this before. It's very cool though. Let's add him to the base. Loads of Ninjago. Let's see what we get next. It is another Ninjago. This is Zane, the Master of Ice, but in my favourite form, FS. Stands for Forbidden Spinjitzu. They all have very nice hoods with like flames of their elemental colour. And Ninjago. We have got a lot of Ninjago figures now. Let's hope for something, maybe a Marvel or a Star Wars. Okay, let's have a look. And it is. Oh, it's a Marvel. I think this is Thor with his very nice little hammer. Let's add him to the Marvel one. <laughs> oh, we haven't got um, that many Harry Potters. Actually, we have not got a Harry Potter yet. I got Harry Potter himself in his Quidditch suit. So let's add him to the random one. There we go. Let's hope for maybe a Stolz. This is a brick built spider thing, I think. Oh, I know where this is from. This is Ninjago crystallized again. <laughs> Got loads of Ninjago. A little spider bot. Came in quite a few sets. And this is another Ninjago. Okay, this is Skylar. This is Chen's daughter. So, she's got the Master of Absorbation. So, let's add Skylar to our board. Oh, I think this is Mysterio from the Lego Daily Bugle. Very nice little set. Oh, oops. It's got a very nice fishbowl kind of head. That's what people call it. Let's add him to our marble. Ninjago, but this, I really love these. This is a golden edition Kai. Extremely cool. It's got a little one sword holder at the back. It's got two faces. Okay, let's add him to our. And our next figure is. Oh, yeah, it's a Marvel. A X Men. This is Wolverine. Wolverine. I think this is also from the Marvel Mystery Minifigure Season 2. Along with Moon Knight. Who else? 
Let's see what else we got. Oh, I think this is Boba Fett from Star Wars. Got a very nice face, a jetpack, and a Mandalorian helmet. Let's add some on to the stock as well. This is another Ninjago. It is a Crystal Warrior. Part Venstone, part Crystal. He can go with the Crystal Spider. <laughs> there we go. We get. Oh, I feel just one piece of there. Oh, the, the seller included us the head for the Dragon Jay. Very, very nice. For Marvel, hopefully. And I got. Oh, yay! It is a Marvel. That's good. Kate Bishop. Again, I think this is from the season two of the Marvel Collectible minifigures. Got a nice new bow and arrow. And a pizza box. What's left in here? Oh, there's only one minifigure. Okay. This looks like a Green Goblin, also from the Daily Bugle, maybe? Who knows, he comes in quite a few sets. So, let's add him to our collection of Marvel. Marvel is starting to build up now. The final things. I have left this one to last, because I've felt it quite a few times. And it is a small set from Dragon's Rising. It's Kai's Dragon. We got the figure for it earlier, which I find very nice this figure okay where is he that yeah right here it's this one so put Kai in there so his mouth opens to reveal a dragon energy ball put that back in and then when you press down on the tail it will literally just go flying onto the floor okay so i'm going to save a future video to well, review all of these minifigures. I hope you enjoyed watching. Bye-bye.